Hi, David. Hi, John. Does this look familiar? Right. A, very much like the kind of tests, grammar tests for students. Right. right? So a multiple choice with three very similar parts of speech. Right? right. And this is often a problem choosing the correct one because they're so similar. Yeah, and I also feel that a lot of people once they learn a word from、uh, from somewhere,、mm. uh, once they know the meaning,、mm. they simply. Put the word in their writing. Yeah, right? right. Put their word in speaking without caring about where to put them. Yeah, quick check in the dictionary. First word they put it in.、Uh -huh. But very often、uh, there are alternative meanings. Right. You need to be aware of that. Yeah. Any suggestions? So I think basically, we, in order to enrich our vocabulary,、mm -hmm. we, we shouldn't just care about the meaning. We should learn about how to use them,、mm -hmm. where to put them, how to position、mm -hmm. the word, and that is、okay. what we call collocation. Okay. All right. So I suggest. Two web resources that we can use. One is a web dictionary, so、mm -hmm. you can immediately check the meaning. Take a look at some examples, and the second one is Web Concordance, where you can find a lot of real examples about how to position a word.、Mm -hmm. Well, let's look at these、uh, online resources, shall we? Yep. Okay. The first thing that I would like to suggest would be web dictionaries, and here on the screen we have Cambridge dictionaries. Okay. This is the web address. And what you need to do is actually very simple. You just type the word in a box, and then press search.、Right. And here you see there are different kinds of explanation. And how about we take a look at this one?、Uh -huh. And in a second, you will have、okay. a page like this. And this is a very great page.、Mm -hmm. And well, simply because it gives you the part of speech here is a noun. And it tells you the explanation here, and very lovely. We have examples of how to use the word. So by reading this, definitely you'll know how to use the word correctly. Yep, it's a useful site. Yep. Okay, David. Now this site is the Virtual Language Centre at the ELC, and it's at this address. And it includes a very useful concordance. It works in a similar way to your dictionary. We type in our target word, and it will list this word located in a number of、uh, different sentences, all of which have been extracted from real documents. For example, government documents, Time magazine, South China Morning Post. That looks interesting. Yep, this is authentic language. And、uh, again, you'll see how it indicates how that word will fit into a sentence. This is called collocation, and it's an important idea.、Uh, if we want to see the full、uh, text from which this extract is taken, we just click on our word, and here is the article itself. And this gives you a very good indication of how this word fits within a sentence. Collocation. Lovely.、Mm -hmm. Well, thanks, yes, David. That's、uh, that's very very satisfaction. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Be careful. Sorry. Please check. Yeah. Okay.、Right. Okay. Okay.、Yeah. So we hope you find these video clips in this semester useful. We've enjoyed making them. Right. So see you again in A three o five.